Dr. Tom. Dr. I'm Tom. I'm the founder of Brace, And I'll give you a thousand bucks off if you say the car and coffee. I like getting cars, building cars, making them sweet and stuff. Just dreams to reality type beat. We got Daniel Mack. In the, oh shit, the it's him, him bro. Sure. Let's yeah. flip it back on him. What do you do for a living? Oh yeah, well, oh. I was going to say your mother, but uh. uh <laughs> we're at Cars and Coffee Orange County this morning. I'm Johnny. This is Sergio. We're going to be asking these supercar owners what they do for a living and how they made it. Let's go. What, what was your name? Dr. Man. I'm Dr. Tom. Dr. I'm the Tom. founder of New Brace, Invisible Braces. Johnny, nice to meet you. Oh, nice more than Invisible. Man. Kind of similar, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we don't have any brackets. That's the okay. difference. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, so better than Invisible. Oh, yeah. And I'll give you a thousand bucks off if you say the car and coffee. Oh, really? <laughs> all right, well, you guys heard that. Beverly Hills. You got to go all the way to Beverly Hills. <laughs> <laughs> There's a company right there. New oh, new brakes. Oh, okay. nice. And what kind of car is this? It's a Ferrari F4, F4 uh, 30. F430. Yeah, they call it uh, Bulletproof. Bulletproof. Yeah. Okay, that's nice, a pretty bro. badass this name. Is my right? Sweetheart friend. She's, uh, she's his, Samantha is his uh, daughter, and that's their awesome car. Oh, that's your guys' right here? Or this one? Yeah. Nice. Right, nice to meet you, Dr. Tom. Tom if you yeah. had to give one piece of advice to the youngsters uh, who are looking to make yeah. it, what would you if give? If you have a direction, go with it. Don't keep switching back and forth. That's go with your advice. path. Good There's advice. Be obstacles, you fall down, you get back up. But every once in a while, consult with people who you respect to make sure you go in the right direction. All right, 100%. Go. You heard it. New brace, not Invisalign. Yeah, my channel is Josh Laurent too. Make all type of crazy cars and stuff like the McLaren. And then I have my AMG GT that I took back to Michigan. Lives one of one too. I, my goal is to make every car one of one and just have fun with them and going crazy, flames, loud. Anything you can do, I'm gonna do. So that's sick, dude. How old are you? 21. 21, dude. What a savage. What do you do for work? YouTube, YouTube, basically, nice. influencer nice. type stuff, type beat. You nice. know. Uh, what's your channel? Uh, Josh Laurent. On YouTube and yep. Instagram? Yep. Cool, man. How many subscribers you got? 297,000. So, oh, almost at 300K. We got to get to 300K. Dude, yeah, I'm 300K. Video, <laughs> let's get it. After yeah, this video, we get there. Yeah, like we'll, we'll help you out the way we can. But, <laughs> but yeah, if you could give someone, I mean, looking to make content or uh, trying to make it and get cars like this, what would you give them? Never miss out on the opportunity. No matter what, if you see somewhere that says it's far or whatever, you never know what can happen. So don't miss out on the opportunity. And then if you get there and nothing actually happens, you don't have that regret of if you stay back and wondering if something could happen. You know what I'm saying? So don't miss opportunity. Always 100%. Yeah. Yeah. Great advice, dude. Hey, follow follow my boy Josh here. Get him 300K. We got Daniel Mack. In the, oh, shit, it's him, bro. What's going on, man? Let's yeah. flip it back on him. What do you do for a living? Oh, yeah. Well, oh, oh, are you filming right now? Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm on live, too, at the same time. Cool. Uh, I was gonna say your mother, but uh, uh, <laughs> but uh, I, you know I ask people what they do for a living. For a living, it's the best job in the world. But I guess you guys are doing it too. So here we go. Talking about <laughs> follow Daniel. What do you do for a living, and what kind of car do you have? So I own uh, Team Road to Safety Driving School. So we're a driving oh. school here, based out of uh, Southern California. Yeah. We primarily teach kids how to drive. That's awesome. Like, yeah. how many locations do you have? Uh, I franchise the business, so we have several franchises in San Diego. Or all of Orange County, Temecula, so Dude. and parts of LA. That's awesome. And so with that business, you were able to like take that and then like do stuff like buy a Lamborghini Huracan, right? right? Yeah, because before that, I was a police officer. Okay. So police how'd officers make... don't make that much money. Yeah, like how'd you make that transition? Um, you know, I, I've seen so many kids and people killed in car crashes. Oh, that's right. So it led me to be able to start a driving school to help. Uh, develop uh, teenagers to become better drivers. We also do a close course driving as well. So anybody of any age that can drive a car could do our close course driving. So we do skid pad and all that as well. Dude, that's awesome. Yeah, and then I'm sponsored by Ford. So the kids get to drive brand new Mustangs when they're learning to drive. That's awesome, man. Yeah. Well, what was your name? Andrew. Andrew. And then what was the, what was the company called? Team Road to Safety. All right, Team yep. Road to Safety, yep. Southern California. Yep. You know, all right, I have thanks, an Instagram man. too. So oh, Instagram, plug it. Uh, TRTS.inc. 
you could give one piece of advice to anybody looking to make it, especially in business, because that's kind of where our content's geared toward, okay. what, would you, what would you recommend? You know, the best advice you, uh, that I can give is you got you to gotta dedicate yourself, truly, you got to sacrifice. Um, the harder you work, the more it comes in, in back to you. So I did a lot of sacrificing. I worked seven days a week, 24 hours a day, and that eventually comes back. You got to keep your, you got to keep it. You got to do something that you're passionate about, because you you got to love what you do. And I love what I do. You know, I lo I'm a car guy too. So that's why when I started my business, I wanted to make sure I had cool cars. That's probably why you started business, right? Absolutely. So you can get the cab yeah. Going and find right. Nice and, and you know, we we do we do custom cars for SEMA as well. So yeah. that's kind of my side business, but I use it also for my marketing as well. Awesome. So any type of business that you do, you can always market it with a car, because look how many people here. That look. show up, and if you do your marketing, no matter what it is, it's a rest. I mean, yeah, whatever it is, you 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 blast it on your social media, you mark it up on your cars, and you you present it here. Yeah. So if you look at my car, it even has TRTS Inc., which is our license plate. It has "Don't drive faster than your angels can fly," which try to promote safety as far as driving is concerned as well. So yeah, yeah. we're just uh, filming people who own nice cars. Asking yeah. them what they do for a living if you're interested. Yeah. Got a camera guy here. Cool. I rent yeah. cars now. <laughs> you rent cars? Yeah. Okay, cool. So that's what you do for a living. You sell uh, like a car rental business? Yeah, so as a general contractor, that's where I made my money was as a general contractor. And I bought my first supercar and fell in love with supercars and the power and everything else with them. And then I met a friend who had a car rental business he wanted to kind of inject supercars into the car rental business. So I started buying exotics. I bought a Huracan and I bought the, the blue McLaren right there. Now those two are both rental cars and they're doing great. And that's how we're getting into the rental car. And now I also have a 2022 STO being built at Lamborghini right now. Oh wow. So, and you're gonna be renting that one? No, no, that's oh, gonna no. be my <laughs> that'll be my daily driver. Yeah. I have a Gallardo, a Lamborghini spider right now. That's supercharged. That's my daily driver. How many do you have in total? Like three right now. And everything? Two rental cars. I have the Lamborghini Gallardo, yeah. and I have the STO being built. Yeah. Is so. so that why you started the business? You're like, hey, I love the supercars. Might as well. Have you driven one? No. Uh, I've never driven a supercar. Okay, so a lot of people. Oh, a lot of people buy supercars because they want to be seen because it's something like that. If you're a real car purist, which is the way I grew up, you love cars for the experience of driving a car for what the car is. The first time I drove my Lamborghini, I was like, oh my God, this car is fast, it's secure, it's, it's, you feel safe in it, it grips the road, and it's just a whole different feel than driving a Camry or, or even a muscle car. And it's just something that I fell in love with, and it, it's addicting. It really is, and you say you've got a fast car, and, and it's fast enough. It's never fast enough. You always want more power just for that one time. But it's just—it's an addiction. You just—you fall in love with the cars, and I love all of these cars. So I tint my windows. I don't like people looking at me when I'm driving, you know, because people look at weird things and think things about you. So keep the windows up. I always leave my doors open so people can go down in the car, pictures. They can do whatever it's about the car not about the car. so in order to afford it, I'm kind of converting from the general contractor and, and the industry that I've been in and I'm getting into rental so and it's a really good way for me to buy the car I've always loved too uh, one piece of advice who's looking I don't know buy a car for themselves one day what would you give them uh, just keep the dream alive don't ever give up on it because they're they're not it's not hard to do it really isn't so just work hard and you'll get them nice man if somebody wants to rent a car where can they find you uh quarter mile exotics you'll see both the the blue mclaren and the white huracan are on there uh my business partner it's actually his company uh he just bought a lamborghini urus yesterday they have an svj and a couple other cars on there so Teslas and all that. So Quarter Mile Exotics, you can find it on uh, Instagram, YouTube channel coming up, TikTok. We got lots of videos, lots of places nice, to get on. This will be on TikTok, so we'll, we'll put all the links down there. Bye Shout on. you out. Quarter Mile Exotics, you heard it. And what locations do you serve? Uh, all of Orange County. Cool.
You're in Orange County, Quarter Mile Exotics. What was your name, man? I'm Chris. Chris, great to meet you, Chris. Johnny. Yeah, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you so much. That's right for this one guys, thanks so much for watching. As you can see, the trend here, start a business, use the cash flow to buy nice things. If you haven't yet, hit subscribe, hit the notification bell, and if you like more videos like this, let us know below. And then let's get this video to like 50 likes. All right, that's the goal, 50 likes, and we'll keep making more of these. We'll see you in the next one, peace.